said, you wrestle against. You know what I mean to wrestle? When you are in a night time, when you are in, when you are in a fight and you are wrestling, what is my time? What is the intention? What is the objective? The objective is to pin your enemy to the ground. And as long as you pin your enemy to the ground, you won the fight. And somebody, I want you to understand, your spiritual fight is no different. You have the power to bind because if you want to spoil the enemy goods in the year 2022, you have to learn that my God how to bind him. Hallelujah! I'm telling you, you cannot bind the strong man, you cannot spoil his goods. Amen. And my God, if you learn how to bind him, how will you see? My God, of course, the devil to surrender. You have to know, come on, somebody. You have to know that you listen to somebody. And it's important how you to understand the soul that is given to you. Amen. The soul of the spirit comes by. When you look how you have the soul that Paul was referring to, it was a soul that comes by that the soul is have. That soul will that soul will, will sharpen on both sides. And if you don't know how to use that soul, you can have lived yourself. So somebody now you could have killed yourself in your own soul because you don't know how to use it. But somebody I want you to understand how we, in this warfare you have to learn and buy how to use that sword properly. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh my God, Father, we give you the praise. Can someone shout thank you, Jesus? Can someone shout thank you, Jesus? Now, beside the soul, and the, I don't have time, so I can't go into it to that praise the name of the Lord. But I want you to understand that you have to be skillful to be able to use that soul. And this is where the church comes in, amen. Yeah. The preaching of the word, the teaching, teaching you how to be able to live in this time, amen. Yeah. So that you, my God, can know the word. You see, I want you to understand the devil is not afraid of you, the devil is not afraid of me. Come on, somebody. The devil is afraid of that which is in me. Greater is ignorance in me than ignorance in the world. Come on, come on. The devil is not afraid of me, but the devil is afraid of the word of God that lives in me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You see, this is the reason why, hallelujah. My God, this is the reason why Jesus had to say to the devil, he said, man shall not live by bread alone, but by everyone. Word that proceeded out of the mouth. But listen to somebody. Jesus had to use the word to, 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 to cause the devil to surrender. Hallelujah. What did he say to the devil? He said, Say that it is. Say that it is. Bitter. I think, man, you have to go through these times knowing the word of God. Hallelujah. The word of God is able to sustain you. Come on to God. Uh, if I, the Jesus said, if I can make you abide in me and my words abide where? In you, then you shall ask whatsoever you will and what will happen. And it shall be given to you. I want you to understand when you have the words of God tonight, my God, the time we were long as a minister Paulton said, my God, you have to just rush everything. So time didn't allow me to do the kind of teaching that we normally do. So I have to jump something tonight. Praise the Lord. But somebody how you have you got to walk in the word and let the word and have the word of God in you. Hallelujah. My shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that we see out of the mouth of God. Now beside the sword, which is the word, our weapons of offense were used. You had the spear and the, the lynch, the, the battle axe, the club, how the bow comes about it. You are listening to somebody. You don't leave up anything. You have the arrows. You have the sling. Come to about I want you to understand my God. I don't care what it takes to defeat the devil. I'm going to use it. Hallelujah. Anything that's necessary to defeat the devil, I'm going to use it. Amen. I got the devil can sit in our title and on fear of war. He can sit in life in business. There is nothing on fear as long as I am staying in the word of God. Amen. Somebody, I listen to me. You know, my God, it is not my God. 
It is not how I, it is not how I make the battles look as long as I can in the will of God in terms of my God, what is necessary to bring you into subjection, what is necessary to call for surrender. I'm going to do it, hallelujah. So at least there's a nasty fight that we are in spiritual here. If you take my God in a spiritual fight, walk in your in the end of your fight against, he's fighting nasty. He's come my God for your children's life. He's come for your husband's life. He's come for your wife's life. He's come my God to take all your friends. God, if you understand, my God, I have been in tears. In tears, you know how many loved ones we lose? My, 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 my daughter's friend, which is us, my son, he loses that. Which his dad will be there with the team on Wednesday. His dad was very strong, very athletic, loved a lot of heights and all those things. And COVID bring him down. So I want you to understand we are fighting against an enemy who don't care who you are. And my God, you have to do whatsoever is necessary. My God, to cause him to surrender. Hallelujah. But now there's no time to sleep. Now there's no time to compromise. Now there's no time, my God, to be just my God for the rebel. And my God, that they're a little lost and can believe yourself in the dead. I want you to understand that you hit now, hit now. I'm not talking about human beings here. I'm not talking about the flesh here. I'm talking in the spirit here. I say, you hit now, hit now. And listen to me, man, to the higher. How do you understand, my God? And I'm hitting you in the order that I believe you can drop your spirit as possible. Hallelujah. My God, you know, listen, you can only do that through the word of God. Yeah. yeah. Jesus said, it is written, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that was shared out of the Lord of God. I will have to stand and resist the devil in the trap of Hallelujah. I am coming to you. You know, I will not talk tonight. Having all that you may receive tonight and even before the stand. Stand. Having all. It means I want you to understand that Paul's come for, uh, for going the extra mile. And calls for pushing uh, more than you have been pushing before. Come on, survive. And I want you to know you will survive. Yes, it is troubling times now and troubling times ahead of us, but you will survive. Praise the Lord. My God, the race is not for the swiftest, neither the battle for the strongest, but for him who can enjoy unto the end. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Tonight, Lord. We want to do something because of the little time that we have. Remember, we have to work with time 